Hey guys, welcome back to DGubs. In this new updated tutorial, I'm going to be showing you the best game websites that are probably unblocked. I'm also going to be showing some tips on making your own and what to do if it gets blocked. Anyways, let's get into it. The first site that I primarily used as a game website is AlgebraHelper.co. This website was up for about a week before they blocked it. This website has lots of games, and one thing I liked about it was the fact that it didn't just embed the games on another URL. It used its own URL to host the games. If you don't understand what I'm saying, it's basically like this. Let's say you have GameWebsite.com, and you find a game on BlockedGameWebsite.com. So then you continue to embed the URL of the game that is hosted on BlockedGameWebsites.com on your website. You'll probably begin to see the issue here. But with AlgebraHelper.co, it hosted the games on its own URL. So if you wanted Subway Surfers, you would click the button, and then it would embed AlgebraHelper.co dot co slash game slash subway surfers slash index dot html in a little box pretty cool right I would recommend this site if your school isn't too harsh on blocking sites immediately. Alright, next up we have hoodamath.com. I think that's how you say it. This site is a math website which is approved from teachers. But little do they know, they snuck in a bunch of uneducational games. They've got all the Papa's games, Bloxers, and Bus Parking. This is a site that I would recommend to any student where their school is on any level of harshness when it comes to blocking games in a matter of time. Teachers would see this on your history and think, what's this? Oh, it's just a math site. I'll let it pass. Finally, we have Google Sites. Not Google Sites in general, but game websites created in Google Sites. I swear these things are easier to make than a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. All you have to do is design it, which a two-year-old could probably do, I think. And then embed a random game. It literally took me 30 seconds to make this. And now everyone in my school is making it. Oh, and if it ever gets blocked, all you have to do is change the name of the site. Anyways, guys, thank you guys for watching. Comment, like, subscribe, and I'll see you later. Have fun.